Hello everyone, Jigu TV here, and in this video we're going to discuss about the level gap penalties for experience gains, soul stone, specialties, items, and gold drop rate. So check this out. I came across some useful information from a reliable source that says, depending on the level gap between the character and the monster, an experience and prize penalty may apply. For golden items first condition, level gap of 7 or below will result to no penalty. Meaning, golden item drop rate is normal. Second, level gap of 8 and above, up to level gap of 39 will result for drop rate reduction based on the gap. Meaning, as the level gap becomes higher, the drop rate becomes lower. We don't have a formula for the decreased drop rate, but we will try to research this furthermore and maybe include it on our next video. Third, level gap of 40 and above, will result to 0% drop rate for golds and items. Now, let's check the authenticity of the third condition, since we can't check the first two because we don't have enough data to prove the drop rate. We are currently at level 59. As you can see, we are killing level 20 monsters. Which means we have a gap of 39 levels from the monster, but it's still within the drop rate range. We are still gaining 1 gold from killing the monsters. Now, let's go past the allowed level gaps. Since there are no level 19 monsters, let's go to level 18 monsters. Now, we have a gap of 41 levels from the monster. As you can see, golds are now unobtainable. This condition also applies to item drops, but we will not show it anymore since the drop rate is too low. Next, let's go to the experience gains. First condition, level gap of 2 or below will result to no penalty. Meaning, experience gain is normal. Second, level gap of 3 and above, up to level gap of 10 will result for experience gain reduction based on the gap. Meaning, as the level gap becomes higher, the experience gain becomes lower. Again, we don't have a formula for the decreased experience gain, but we will try to research this furthermore and maybe include it on our next video. Third, level gap of 11 and above, will result to an obtainable experience. Now, let's check the authenticity of the third condition, since we can't check the first two because we don't have enough data to prove them. We are currently at level 59. Since there are no level 49 monsters, let's go to level 50 monsters. As you can see, we are killing level 50 monsters. Which means we have a gap of 9 levels from the monster, but it's still within the range where we can gain experience. Experience is still obtainable. Now, let's go past the allowed level gaps. Let's try 11 level gaps, in this case, level 48 monsters. It is now past the level gap range so we can see, experience is now unobtainable. These conditions only applies to monsters lower than your current level. Same goes with golds and items. In the next scene, we'll show you a glimpse when we try it on higher level monsters. Last, Monster Soul Stones and Specialties. Soul Stones and Specialties are not affected by the level gap. As you can see, we are killing level 6 monsters which is way beyond the level gap requirement. Soul Stones can drop easily. So that concludes our video. If you like our content, please subscribe and click the thumbs up button. Thank you for watching and see you on the next video.